Hello guys, this is Gemini Jets Fan 1 here bringing you a new video today. Today we're going to be reviewing the Gemini Jets 1 for 100 Jet Blue in the I Heart Blue York livery. Um, this is a 2016 release by them. Yep. So, just in case anybody was running um, what year they released it, 2016. Um, and I'm not going to really go into a lot of the box detail just because it's very standard with every Gemini Jets. They give you the basic livery on the front and then the basic livery on the inside. So let's get right into the model. So um, my first impressions of this model, honestly, um, is that this model is stunning. Out of all the issues um, that people have been having with Gemini Jets lately, regardless of the year, just like with handling, you know their overall integrity, I guess you would say, of their brand right now. This has to be one of their high peaks. Um, this model is by far one of the best A320 molds, I guess you can say, in my personal opinion. Now, this isn't speaking for everybody. I don't want to have people come in the comments saying, no, this brand is better for my personal um, experience. This A320 that's sitting in front of my face, beautiful. Um, I very much love the antenna box on top, the extreme, um, just overall clean, cleanly look of the model side. These, these, um, you see the amazing detail on the engine, the I Heart New York Jet Blue. Um, here we have the two overwing exits. Right boarding door. The registration November 5 6 or November 5 8 6 JB. Um, same thing on this side. Again, I just love the white on this plane, it makes it stand out so much more. Um, And I did get this model off High Country Hobbies. I did get the last one, but if you guys could um, find this model, I do highly recommend. It's amazing in detail and it's worth your money. I paid 47 bucks for this with shipping, so it wasn't a bad deal either. Um, I really hope that Gemini Jets continues to make their A320s like this. Um, or at least bring the same value to a lot of their models. I understand it takes a lot more to just whip up a model than you know a lot of us collectors think, but from what I can see of this model, I don't see why they couldn't have added it to say a model like this. Now this is the first um, Gemini Jets A321. Again, this doesn't have the antenna box and I believe one of the antennas on top came off broken so I mean like I said I know Gemini just has their ups and downs but if we can stop putting out say models like this where they're half done just to you know rush to be the first to put them out I would think that people would appreciate them more to just wait for better models instead of just trying to one up another company or vice versa but um Enough about all that. At the end of the day, this model is beautiful and I highly recommend. If you guys enjoyed this review, I hope you guys comment, rate, and subscribe and stay tuned for more.